Oh, good morning, sir. Good morning, New York City. What is today? So day five, day four. Soph and I are being good students again this morning. We're actually heading straight to a cafe to get some work done instead of shopping around for like three hours. And then I think we decided on the Upper East Side, darling. We might go to the Met. Yeah, that's kind of the plan for today. We don't... Oh, that's lovely. Everyone go cheer yourself on. Woo! <laughs> if anyone's curious about my eye update, it's actually doing a lot better. Anyways, that's the update. Update you at Starbucks. Oh, wave. <laughs> Hi vlog. Soph and I finished our studying at Starbucks. So Soph and I are going to the Met in sweats. <laughs> yeah. What oh, do you want to do about it? Yeah. Nothing. But, but we have our cool Nikes. We do. And we're wearing, I'm wearing all brown, James wearing all, all blue. All blue. So, you know what? We look cute enough. Yeah. We'll keep you posted. We might make a couple stops along the way, but we're headed towards the Met and the Upper East Side. But every time we've been going, like, we, you know, we say that's our destination. Yeah, it takes, it takes us three hours, hours to get there because we get distracted. Because <laughs> it's New York City, baby. It's New that's York. the point, you know. Okay. The distractions make the adventure. Oh, that's a cute. That that would be like printed on a Forever Twenty One hoodie. <laughs> cool. Look who it is, Miss Sophie herself. <laughs> it's my place. It is her place. Hi, vlog. Sophie and I just picked up sweet greens, and now we're heading to the park. Wait, look how cute the bag is. So, if I want to model the sweet greens bag for us. It's got a little. <laughs> it's cute, it goes with your fit. It does. I belong in the forest. Like the only jungle we're in is the concrete jungle. <laughs> Shake it, shake it. Sweet That's greens time. is so good. We were thinking it might be like comparable to Mandy's back at home, but much better. Um, sweet green really showed Mandy's the dressing. up. It's like the a dressing, it's like the dressing fire. Anyway, so we're just eating in the park, like two little New York City gals with the swirls. We're gonna eat and then make our way to the Met, darling. Oh my god, it sounds so bougie. I know, in the upper and inside. we're doing all in sweats. <laughs> exactly. I think that humbles it. Oh yeah. Like we, you know, stay humble. Stay humble. <laughs> Update time. Soph and I made it to the iconic. Yeah, this is gonna be our thumbnail. <laughs> no, you can't even see it. Oh, can you not? No, I. But the stairs. The red one, though. There's a sign that says the Met. Let's find oh. it. Oh, let's get closer. Try number two. It's along the stairs. Wait. There's so much bird shit. <laughs> Wait, no, Did you have to tilt it up. I literally can't Bend see down. shit. Like that? You can't. Oh, this? There. <laughs> we did it. Yay! Should have brought yogurt, isn't that? Yeah. Yeah. What they eat in Gossip Girl, they always eat yogurt oh, on true. the steps of the Met. Guys, we're having a little Gossip Girl moment. I'm Serena, and so is Blair. Blair. My nose is leaking like a faucet. Yummy. Blair would. <laughs> Vlog update. We're not allowed. I figured you wouldn't be allowed glass bottles, but oopsies. I figured we should try anyways. Um, but you're not allowed glass bottles in the Met. So we're chugging some green tea. Would Serena do this? Serena would. No. On the steps of the Met? Chugging green tea? No, Serena would be looking for Dan. Dan. Look at all these people are getting ahead of us in line. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all these people. I'm classy. Hey MTV, welcome to our crib. You made lots of ripples. Now we're walking in the Upper East Side. It feels quite fancy. Anyways, we're just gonna walk around a little. We've made it to Maman, which is this other. Apparently, it's Oprah's favorite. 
chocolate chip cookie. Is it but, Oprah's favorite? Yeah. The top two, like the final two girls, two girls when they voted, one of them loved Levain, which we love, and yeah. then the other one voted for Mama. So we naturally, we have to try. Chocolate chip cookie. Taste test. Thank you. Oh. Okay. okay. Oh, there's this nuts. Is, wait, well, like, this is the cookie. Does okay, yours have cheers. nuts? Yeah, I think mine has a nut in there. Yeah. Okay. Mmm. I just got an awful of nuts. That's what she said. That is what she said. Mmm. Listen. It's not that good. It's an, no, I, I like, it's an interesting cookie. Yeah. But in terms of a chocolate chip cookie, this is not. This is not a chocolate. And I kind cookie. of understand what the Erin girl from Buzzy was saying. Mm -hmm. She's like, this is a very good cookie, but Levine has a really good simple chocolate chip. Like, if you're craving a simple cookie, this is not it. But if you're feeling a little bougier, yeah. If you want to like, yeah, dress up a chocolate chip cookie. Like this is. It. Ooh, oh, I got so many crumbs on me. Oh. But this is it. Ooh. We just took a bite out of it. Levine definitely wins over Levine definitely my mom. Wins. But if you want to dress up a classic chocolate chip cookie, then yeah, I think this is a cool option. Monsters. We're gonna get ready for bed. Chill out. Maybe watch some basketball. I want a peanut butter m &M. Nice. It's also a happy National Peanut Butter Day. You have to have one. Okay. Morning vlog. Coming at you looking like an egg because we did a sleep back hair look today. So if now we're going to Brooklyn. Woo! Obviously we're walking through Soho again because the hoes love Soho. What else is new? What else is new? So we're gonna walk through Soho. Maybe go to Bubby's. Do the Brooklyn Bridge. Here's the fit. We got baggy jeans, the Converse, white ribbed long sleeve, and the iconic UCLA vest. <laughs> and we're doing the little Marc Jacobs bag today, so. I feel like it's not doing justice because I'm wearing an ugly coat and a scarf, but I'm wearing corduroy pants and a white long sleeve like Jamie's. Woo, Miss RBG is coming to Brooklyn with us. Yeah, I think this vlog should be entitled Bubby's Take Brooklyn. Bubby, yeah, Bubby's in Brooklyn yeah. is today's vlog. I'm yeah. 6% Jewish, but... So, it counts. It counts. Oi vey. <laughs> Let's go to Brooklyn. So, if I obviously had to go back to Stumptown. Look how cute. It's but very Brooklyn. cute. Hi. It matches Jamie's nails and stuff today. It does. It matches the aesthetic for today anyways. Cheers. So, if I are looking at apartments... Oh, chef's kitchen. ...as if we can afford any of them. <laughs> can anybody buy me an 8.5 million dollar house? And now, pancake time. This review of Bubby is phenomenal. Amazing. I get the pancakes, the avo toast, and if the you cold get the, brew. If you get the pancakes, I highly recommend what Jamie got with the blueberry compote. It's yeah. delicious. It kind of reminds you of this nostalgic blueberry pie filling. Thing. The cold brew was amazing. Everything was really good. Literally, it was like, adorable inside. We love adorable. you, Bubbies, and we got yeah. some mugs to go because it was literally so cute. Yeah. And now we're headed to the Brooklyn Bridge on this phenomenal day. See you in Brooklyn, bitches. We don't really know where we are exactly, no, but... It's so cool. Wow. We're sitting on a bench now. We're on Fruit Street. Oh, which is really cute. how sweet. I know. Is that there? Yeah, I get it. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, 
you guys is a vegan scone. We found the best lemon blueberry vegan scone you'll ever it's have. Incredible. From Alice's, Alice's Bakery or Alice's, Alice's tea, tea Room. It's so good. Anyways, that was a very fun find. Very fun detour. We just saw, you know the guy at Washington Square Park who The guy on TikTok. Random like, people. And he walks up to people and he asks them like. And he's so unapologetic and he's absolutely hilarious. He's incredible. Anyways, he's here right now. And Soph and I don't know his name, but we see him. And I, I, I'm i kind of fangirling, even though. A little bit. He's iconic. He's, he's actually iconic. He goes up to people of all ages, asks the funniest questions, and he's honestly just like. It's incredible. Anyways, he's, incredible. he's here. And. We found out I his thought, name. We figured it's out his name. Davis Burleson. And he has 1.5 million like, followers on TikTok. And we saw him. We were too embarrassed to go up to him. Um, yeah, but it's also because he had a whole squad around him. Yeah, like a posse. he looked popular. He like, I'd be around with like, a hype crew. Yeah, anyways, it looks like he was looking for his neck. We could technically go seat ourselves somewhere in Washington Square Park and yeah, like, act like we didn't see him. Should we stay on the sunny side? Yeah, I want to be in the sun. Anyways, Davis Burleson. We saw him in the flesh. We saw him. He's adorable, incredible. I'm had a beautiful him, outfit on. Yeah. Like, he had an awesome outfit on. He had an awesome outfit. He was well dressed. And anyways, does that count as spotting a celebrity in New York? I think so. Spotted. This is proof. So I've got live footage of him. Uh, oh, yeah. need the best quality. <laughs> so a little paparazzi. So this got. is our selfie together. Me and Davis. <laughs> <Thumbnail>. <laughs> Vlog. Um, so if and I are going to Beacon's Closet, which we're really pumped about because it's like this vintage store. Yeah, it was cute and there was stuff. Yeah, just because it wasn't like it wasn't like nice stuff, you know. Yeah, and it's also the layout made it such as kind of crowded in there, but yeah, like it was just okay. Nothing in exciting news though. I mean, I actually did get something. I've been looking for this baggy bag for so long. It's the smiley oh. face one. Oh, lovely. Okay, hi vlog. So listen. A lot has happened since we last updated you. Soph and I did lots of shopping, but obviously we got tired. So we were like, let's go to our favorite Rubies for dinner. They were yeah. like, mm, 40 minute wait. And we were minutes. like, we don't want to do that. So yeah. we were like, how about Ruby Rosa? And they were like, that's going to be an hour and yeah, what, 30 uh, minutes? Yeah, like an hour and a half. Wait. And wait. we were like, absolutely not. So we were like, oh, did we cut this night short? What do we do? And we were like, screw it. Also, my phone's at 6%. All this to say, so we put our names down at Rubies because we were like, fuck this, we want Rubies. And then Soph, had the genius idea. We were like, what the fuck are we gonna do for 40 minutes? So I was like, should we go pick up Levain for later? Yes. I don't <laughs> even think, no, end of clip. We don't even need, to, you guys don't even know, need to know what the answer to that is because you should already know it's hell to the fucking yes. Also, we're gonna Uber back to the hotel because. Exhibit A is to why we're gonna Uber back to the hotel later. All right, catch you at Levine. So we saw a board oh, yeah, we from saw New Zealand. We're in an Australian themed restaurant. Yeah. We just had some bomb ass cocktails and now we're eating amazing fries. Amen. 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 End of the day. Amen. So, I'm sorry. <laughs> Ruby's is Guys, we, so good. We love rubies. Food, delicious. Delicious. The portions, like, phenomenal. phenomenal. <laughs> Price, great. Great. Atmosphere, we could, awesome. We could go on for hours yeah. about rubies. Anyways, if we had to recommend one restaurant in Soho to you guys, it would. <laughs> that bike got almost got. Oh, we almost. also saw Lord. Oh, no, you told them. Yeah, I told them. We, we saw Lord. legit saw Lord, you guys. We were waiting like, for Lord. our table. And this girl. Wait, so come here. It's bad lighting. We legit were waiting for our table and this girl walks by and I'm like, in my head, I'm like, mm, that girl looks like Lord. Mm -hmm. And then Soph turns to me, she goes, that was Lord. And I was like. Yeah, she's with her boyfriend and her really cute dog. Or maybe, what happens if we, oh my God, what happens if we out her? What happens if she's not like out with her boyfriend yet? What if we saw her boyfriend yeah, before? for the first time. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> well, you heard it here, folks. He's really cute, the dog's really cute. Sub vlog. We're gonna do a quick haul before I get changed into my PJs. First. I got my bag you bag that I've been wanting for so long. It's the smiley face one, and I found a Beacon's closet. So that was mucho exciting. Um, Bubbies, they had the cutest little mugs ever. Let's unbox one just to see. It says pie for breakfast. How cute, and it has the little Bubbies. 
insignia. Next, you guys are actually gonna shit yourselves. This is a so fine. Thank you. Shout out Soph. We went to, so we didn't find anything in Beacon's closet, but we went to Buffalo Exchange. We were pretty impressed. These bad boys. Okay, a goldie. They're used but barely. Like these things feel brand new. Legit 34 bucks. Like back at home, these things are 198 at Aritzia. Are you kidding? They're a little big. Like they're a, a size or two above what I normally wear, but um, they're just so cute and they have to come home with me for the summertime. And then um, finally, we really just overdid ourselves with brandy, but who gives a shit? Because it's cute basics that we're gonna wear. Um, I just got this white little tank. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna do a full haul. So this isn't from today. I'm just gonna do quickly the other stuff too. White little tank love and then the black version of our pants because we love our flare out pants so much that i got a black version too because i don't have any black sweatpants it's cute little black ribbed tank same one but in white or actually it's a little different but cute and then these jeans super cute again a little bit big but we like the baggy look and the legs are straight down and then the same so i bought this yesterday this tank top in gray but i loved the cut so much that when i found the white one today i was like say less you know well i got these from me and i was from the m m store because i stole his m m boxers so i figured i'd get him new ones so i got him the peanut ones the yellow ones and then i got myself the yellow ones oh thank god look how cute and then you're not ready for this part the butt says i'm the nutty one I love these. Oh, also this long sleeve, this white long sleeve. Yay. Today's our last day vlog. Soph and I are bummed. We have to figure out how to get COVID tested first. So <laughs> the day cannot begin until Soph and I have a way home. But then, I don't know. We're probably gonna go to Chelsea. Maybe Grand Central, we have to get Lil a pressed penny <laughs> because she loves pressed pennies. Let's take on the day. <laughs> Soph and I are in matching hoodies for our final day. Woo! We're at Bluestone and we're eating our apples from Whole Foods. <laughs> and They're like $1.50, but I can understand why it's so they weigh two pounds. Yeah, come on. We found a penny machine for Lil. For those who don't know, uh, Lily Lily collects, collects press pennies. Yeah, Lil collects pressed pennies. So the whenever are impossible to find nowadays. Yeah, whenever we travel, she always asks us for pressed pennies, but they're impossible to find. So we had to go on the collector like dot org website, yeah. and it told us Bubba Gump Shrimp had lie. a pressed penny machine. And look at this, all at the souvenir penny. We, we got your penny, Lily. Give us a thumbs up. Shake Shack again and then go see a musical. This store last night in New York. It's sad. I know, but it's where else would we spend it? A Shake Shack. Is it good? It's so good. We made it home in legit like eight minutes. Like our walk was supposed to be 20 minutes. Soph and I power walked. That was only because Jimmy's bladder was about to explode from her uh, bladder buster lemonade. That's fair. If you guys couldn't tell from that last clip, I don't even know what I got from that last clip. We love you, New York. <laughs> I had to pee something fierce. Soph and I need to pack. We need to check into our flight tomorrow and we need to figure out how the fuck we're gonna get home. Woo! Woo! Hi vlog. It's our last morning. 
fucking depressing. It's depressing and it's early because Soph and I insist on going to get coffee at Stumptown for one last time. Yeah, it's really Montreal, Trudeau, Seated in zone one to four to board at day fifty one. I'm home. <laughs> 